welcome back to my channel. So first off, I wanted to say Happy New Year's to everyone. I hope this year brings all of you nothing but happiness and joy. And I am so blessed to have each and every single one of you here with me today. I put up a poll on Instagram and I gave you guys the choice of a January playlist or a Q&A. And the Q&A won, so that's what we're going to be doing today. So for everyone who did vote for the January playlist, I will be doing that video next. I just wanted to give you guys the option of what you wanted to see from me sooner. In that poll, I got a bunch of amazing questions and I have them here on my iPad. And basically, I'm just going to be reading them off and I'm going to be answering them for you guys today. Without further ado, let's get started. So the first question I chose was, what are some good TV shows? Some of my favorite TV shows are Friends, One Tree Hill, Vampire Diaries, um, The Carrie Diaries, Grey's Anatomy, and Once Upon a Time is really good. I love that show. That was a really good series. So the next question is, what is my favorite hobby and why? So my favorite hobby would probably be singing or drawing. And um, for me, that's just because they're both so relaxing and they both allow me to express myself. The next question is, what is my favorite song to sing? My favorite song to sing is Sweater Weather by The Neighborhood. Um, there's no like specific reason for this. It's just, I think it's a really awesome song and it has kind of like a mixture of like emotion, but it's also like super like a beat and like nice and like it's super energizing and I just love it. So the next question asked was what made me decide to do YouTube? The reason I started YouTube was just because I like to express myself in different ways and put myself out there. It's also a really good way to make people smile and that's something that I personally enjoy and I thought it would be awesome to create content for you guys to watch. But this next question is, do you think that YouTube is going to be a career or just a hobby? The main reason I started YouTube was just as another hobby, but if it does become a career, I wouldn't be like upset with that because I think that's really cool. So I think that it could possibly be a career, but maybe just a side career because I also have another career that I want to do. The next question is, what is my favorite song right now? My favorite song at the moment would probably be Ava by Fami. And that song is such a beautiful song. I love it so much. It has so much energy and like love in it. And I will show you guys that song on my January playlist. And so watch out for that. But yeah, that's my favorite song at the moment. But the next question is, what are some of my favorite stores to shop at? I don't personally shop a whole bunch, but if I were to choose some clothing stores that were my favorite, I would probably have to say Forever 21 or Charlotte Russe. This next question is, have you ever dealt with fake friends? So yes, I have dealt with fake friends numerous times. And the advice that I would give for that is to distance yourself away from that person. You deserve what's best for you, and I definitely believe if distancing yourself away from toxic people in your life is the solution, then to definitely do it. So this next question is, where do you want to be in five years? So within the next five years, I would like to graduate high school and then go to college to become an RN and then once I get my medical degree to work in the neonatal intensive care unit. On top of my career and stuff, I would like to meet someone and I don't think I will have a child in the next five years, but if I do end up having one, then that's just what life brings me. Basically in the next five years, I just want to be happy doing something that I love. This next question is who or what do you consider to be your biggest inspiration? So for me, I consider my parents my biggest inspiration. For those of you who don't know, my parents were both teenage parents. They had me when my dad was 17 and my mom was 19. And neither of them came from very wealthy families. So basically they had to do everything from scratch and just go out and get a bunch of jobs. I am really blessed to have parents who changed their entire lives and left everything behind for me. And I just hope that one day I can be like them. Not saying that I want to be a teen parent, but just hoping that I can do what they never got to. The next question is, what is your definition of success in life? So for me, I believe that success in life is doing what you've always wanted to do and doing something that makes you happy and just basically living life the way you want. Our next question is what is one thing you want people to take away from who you are? If there's one thing that people can take from me, I want them to just be the best person that they can be. I know I'm not the best person that I can be and I am working on that. And basically, I just want people to always try the hardest in life and do something that makes them happy. This last question and 
one of the most important questions to me is, is it worth it? You can interpret this question in many different ways, but I interpret it as life. And yes, I believe it's worth it. I believe that you are strong and you are amazing and you can do anything that you put your mind to and everything that you do impacts someone else and everything that you do is worth it. So without further ado, I'd like to say thank you all for watching and I am so blessed to have every single one of you and I am so glad that I can create videos for you and I hope you guys really enjoyed this video and I will see you guys next time. Bye guys. Thank you.